Hey everybody, welcome back to KJO Views. I am your host, of course, KJO, coming to you with a review from four only murders in the building brought to you by Hulu. But as always, before we get started, like, comment, subscribe, share, 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 and share again. All right, so Only Murders in the Building stars Steve Martin, Martin Short, and Selena Gomez. Uh, it's a mystery comedy built as a true crime podcast. Essentially, what happens is Steve Martin, Martin Short, both live in this building. Well, sorry, all three of the people live in this building uh, in Upper West Side, Manhattan. A murder occurs. They all follow true crime podcasts and they decide to solve the murder in the form of a true crime podcast. Now, just to give you guys some context for those who don't know, Upper Manhattan, Upper West Side Manhattan uh, buildings can be a lot of stories, a lot of residents, a lot of stories in more ways than one, a lot of residents on each floor um, who could live there like from the time they're child to old, you know, um, it, it's not unknown. So that's just to give you some background on what kind of living situation is going on. This isn't some regular apartment building, just so you know, like Upper West Side, Manhattan, it, apartment buildings are, are a different sort of beast. They're living homes. As the podcast or as the show continues, we of course start start learning secrets about our main characters first. And then we start to also peel back layers of who done it, you know. Um, so that that's one of the biggest draws of the show because a, a lot of people love a good who done it mystery in that sense. Immediately fresh off the bat, Steve Martin, he has his cheeky deliveries, which I think are just brilliant. He comes in and he says this thing that's like, you know, oh, I'm Steve Martin, like I'm giving my cheeky delivery. And then you have Martin Short, who gives you body comedy, like the whoa, 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 whoa. And then, you know, he's also very good to me at like having <laughs> these uh, facial expressions that just, I, I don't know, they just comedically just fit and register every situation you put them in. And then it will, and then you just have Selena Gomez, which I I believe is there to, you know, attract a younger demographic, which makes sense because I mean I I knew Steve Martin and Martin Short as like my parents' generation of comedy, but I still remember watching their movies as a child. Um and even I guess to close to my teenage or through my teenage years. Um but that I still knew that they were of you know, that generation, uh, um, still brilliant, but that generation. So I, I think they do good by casting Selena Gomez to attract the younger crowd. And it also builds the attention for a, young, uh, for a true crime podcast, I'm sure. But as you kind of get rid of everyone's alibi, we're getting and, and uncover more stories about our victim. We're getting a lot closer to who, who done it. And it's a very exciting draw in that sense. Uh, the, the, the pace of this show is, is very good. I very much enjoy that. Um, I, I want to hurry up and get to the end and see who done it, but it's definitely, is 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 of course you have our comedy and you have our story and you have the pool and then you have the true crime podcast of it. Um, so it's just a very good show that I highly encourage people to check out in that sense. All in all, I highly recommend the show for anyone who likes True Crime Podcasts, anyone who likes mysteries, anyone who likes whodunits, um, and anyone who likes old, that old school comedy that uh, Steve Martin and Martin Short bring to any and every um, thing they're a part of. So again, that's Only Murders in the Building, streaming on Hulu, uh, Fall 2021. As always, like, comment, subscribe, share, 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 and tell someone to tell someone else about me. I'll catch you guys on the next flick.